Now, absolutely loads has happened since I last made a video. I don't really know where to start, but let's start with the upholstery. Do you remember that horrible orange upholstery that was in there? Well, I decided to have it all covered in uh, cream pretend leather. The thing was, when I came to see it, I didn't have my key. The upholstery man still had my key. So when I came here, it was snowing, I had a look through the window, and this is what I saw. Awesome. Yeah, it looks amazing. Okay, after the upholstery, what next? The floor. Do you remember the floor was all kind of uneven? I was worried about the woodworm and everything. I decided to get the floor uh, covered over with plywood. I didn't do that myself because I thought it's something that I really needed an expert for. Um, and then over the top of it, I had lino put over the top. I wouldn't choose lino like in my house or anything, but I just thought it was really practical for the caravan. So I've had a pretend, a fake wood lino. I'm really pleased with it. I'll show you that in a second. And then I decided to pay a decorator to come and do the cupboards and things in the caravan. Now, I'm quite lucky because my family runs the painting and decorating business, so that was quite convenient. So he did all the basic work, and then last week my daddy came to do the wallpapering and some of the finer kind of paintwork. He put up this gorgeous purpley pinky toile French wallpaper, which I really loved. Now, now comes the but then <laughs> I decided I didn't love it as much as another wallpaper that I found. So unfortunately, he's had to come back today to finish a job. So come inside and I'll show you what he's doing. Right, so we're inside now and you can see my dad there is um, sorting out the wallpaper in the bathroom. <laughs> So that was the wallpaper that was in uh, on the walls. There it is there, it's really lovely, but it's just not as nice as that. <laughs> so poor dad today has had to change all the wallpaper around to this, but I'm really, really pleased with it. I just think it looks really classic and traditional. This is um, by a company called Zoffany, and they're actually based in Milton Keynes. <laughs> um, but I love that. It's really old fashioned and I think it's taken from an original toile as well, which is obviously a French style of wallpaper. Um, the other thing I've done today, which I'm really excited about is this. So over the years, I've been collecting um, old photographs um, and I just thought I'd use some of them in here. I decided where I wanted them, pasted the wall and then pasted onto the back of the pictures. I've stuck them all up and they're just drying at the moment. And then um, I've got some special varnish that's a matte varnish as well. And that's gonna go over the top. So if anything kind of goes on it, like um, tea or anything like that, then it won't stain it. Um, and there's a little bit of um, kind of Victorian risque pictures in there as well, which I'm a fan of. Um, and some holiday pictures and one was a postcard. And I just think that really makes for a nice little story with the caravan. Like Dad said, you know, they could be people who'd stayed in this caravan from all those years ago. So I'm really pleased with that. We just need to finish all the paintwork, which is what I'm getting on with now. And then we're gonna call it a day. 